What's up guys, it's the Big Zeaster here, and we are finally in Rustboro City as you guys seen last time. Too many people walking around. Let's see what kind of stuff they sell. Probably some good shit. Bye. Hey, they got this stuff. This stuff, I think, also uh, increases happiness, so I might just go get my fee bass. <laughs> Uh, restore the HP of Pokemon 20 points. Yeah, whatever. So, not bad. I mean, not very good, but not bad either. Now, I want to do the story, but I also kind of want to go ahead and hit that gym. Ah. I'm kind of scared. Because it's supposed to be a rock gym, but this is randomized. Let's do the story real quick. Which I don't think there is one. Not yet, at least. Eh. We'll do it after the gym. Because I kind of want to get in there just to see what she has. Um. Should I, should I fight these trainers? I'm going to. I'll show you why we're better. <laughs> Seal. Oh, an ice type. Huh. What's nature power do inside this building? Swift. Now, I really don't have an answer to an ice type, I don't think. But he is a... I think he's mainly water. Ah, yes. That was quite a bit of XP there. I hope Laura doesn't die. <laughs> Laura's going to be like the front man for this gym. If you can't beat me, you won't stand a chance against Roxanne. That's a clever name. Roxanne, since she has rock Pokemon. I remember her having a nose pass that was like level 16. That was a pain in the ass to get past. Swablu, a flying type, that's... Um, nature power. Flying, I think it becomes like Flying Dragon, because it's in a Dragon Gym later in the game. Get out of here, Swablu. Chinchu, um, water, electric, no, we keep our lore out, uh, absorb, you're still water type, damn right I had his energy drain, uh oh, uh oh, Laura, you can't be confused, Laura is not one to be confused, you can't stop her, Ah, damn it. You can stop her. <laughs> oh, no. I'm rolling two dice. Oh, that's not gonna work. Chinchu, you'd have like Thunder Shock or something. Or Charge. Oh, come on, Laura. Come on, we can do this. Come on, me and you. Damn, I'm rolling two sets of dice. I'm rolling one just to get through the confusion to attack, and I'm rolling another one to get through paralyzation to attack. Aha, there we go. Give me your life energy. Now, do I have anything to help that? Oh, look. The cherry berries that we picked up before coming into this town. <laughs> we might be in the middle of town, but so what? My rock Pokemon need room to rampage. 
That's if you have rock Pokemon. Oh my god, look at that rock. <laughs> oh, I should probably switch out. Uh, Pokemon. Oh, you know what? Larry would be great because he's rock ground. Doesn't affect Larry because of my rock type. Now let's do bite. What? It's not fair, Pikachu. How come all these Pokemon do something when you hit them? Shroomish, you get um, either asleep or paralyzed when you hit it because it has that freaking spore touch or whatever. Uh, Ian has that charm touch where if you hit him with a physical attack, you get in love with him. Now, Pikachu, you get paralyzed when you punch him. See Pikachu. Execute. Hmm. Uh, I was going to say Caleb, but... You know what? Let's do Ian. Execute a... Grass only? Ah, uh, let's see. Attack missed? I've been missing with everything. Barrage? Oh, no. Oh, that didn't do shit. There you go, you butthole. You just a bunch of eggs. Ian is like my put them asleep, lower their attack, confuse the hell out of them. <laughs> and also use pound. All six of them were asleep. Good job, Ian. Use this one. Give it to Larry. There we go. I think we're ready to fight the gym leader. As ready as we'll ever be, anyway. Oh, I'm kind of scared. <laughs> I'm going to lead with Laura. Yeah, leave with Laura just in case she does have a rock type. Okay, let's see what you got. She's gonna have like a Kyogre. <laughs> oh my god, three Pokemon. Pineco, that's. I wanna say it's Bug Steel? I can't remember what Pineco is. Let's hit it with a grass move. Protect. Wow. Okay. Yeah, it's a bug. I think it's bug steel. Which means I need water. Fire would mess this thing up. We just have to out hit it. Hit it more times than it can hit us. Which I think I can survive. I think Laura will be alright here. Ah, oh, skill potion. I should have brought out Ian first so I could put it to sleep and lower its attack, confuse it. Wow. Come on, come on. Like how Swift always hits. Laura! Tighten your butt cheeks. Oh. 
Oh my god. Um, Nidorino. Nidorino was poison type. What's good against poison? I think ground is good against poison, but I don't have any ground type moves. You know what? <coughs> I hope Nidorino doesn't fucking self-destruct too. Ooh, he looks mad. Ooh. Will at least give you a little bit of damage each turn. Uh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. The Reno sometimes gives no fucks. <sighs> Goodbye, Larry. No. He's <sighs> got fighting type moves. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh. This crazy ass has fighting type moves. Ian. If I switch into Laura, she's gonna die. If I switch into Ian, he's gonna die. Kayla. Her regular defense is horrid. Mmm. Oh man, I didn't train enough. What if I if I send in Cindy, she's gonna die immediately. I might lose two Pokemon in this battle. Best case scenario, I'm gonna lose Cindy and somebody else. Oh let's throw Kayla in. How? Um, 10 HP, that's not good enough. Um, oh my god, Laura has so much health. Uh, don't die, Kayla, don't die, don't die, don't die. One HP, one HP. You know what? I'm gonna go for it. Ah, damn it. Oh, Kayla. Oh, no. Oh, Kayla. Okay, Cindy. Okay, uh, I don't know why my recording stopped. Like, just out of nowhere. But I'm in a little bit of a pickle here. I decided to challenge the gym. Gym leader, Roxanne. And, oh my god. <laughs> I'm in a pickle. Uh, Laura, halfway down. Larry almost died immediately. I sent Kayla out to eat a hit so I could heal Laura. And I only was able to apply one potion. Now, I, I, caught, I went to the forest, I caught Cindy at level 6, but now she's just going to be fodder so I could get Laura back out. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, potion use on Laura. Oh, I hope I didn't lose that recording. My screen recorder app just stopped, like it just stopped recording. I have no idea why. Uh... Yeah, so far this episode, I just came in, came into town and then immediately went for the gym, and now I'm in this pickle. Nidorino does not fuck around. Goodbye, Cindy. Oh. The pain. Oh. 
Wait. Ian. I can put put him to sleep, lower his attack. Hopefully. Oh, I don't like that, I don't like that, I don't like that. Confuse him. Charm. Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Damn it! Goodbye, Ian. Goodbye! Oh. Oh, Ian's gone too. Ian is gone. Oh. Laura, you're the only one. Oh my god. He's poison. So grass isn't really going to do anything. Let's see what Swift does. Hopefully it does work. Hit yourself, hit yourself. Damn it. Wait. Wait, can I do this? Oh, no. Oh. Didn't heal that much. Oh, no. He's going to go second, which means he's going to do something horrible. Oh, shit. Come on, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Please do it, please do it, please do it. Yes. Hit him, hit him, hit him. Take his health, take his health. <clears throat> one more, one more. Whew. Oh my god, Nidorino. I'm shaking. I'm a reap. Um, no. Oh my god. Level, wait, level 12? Can I just take some health from him? I, oh no. Oh no. Oh wait, no, I didn't do shit. <laughs> I guess my, oh yeah, my special defense is not bad. And Thundershock, I guess, isn't really the strongest move. I think we're, we're going to survive. We are going to survive, boys. Hopefully. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. One more, one more, one more. Oh, please, one more. That was a crit. No, don't, don't fail on the last one. No. Don't crit, don't crit, do not crit, do not crit. Uh, Laura. <sighs> oh. We've won. But at what cost? Pokemon League's rules that the trainers are to be given this if they defeat a gym leader. Stone badge. Oh my god. Oh dear lord. I can use cut outside of battle. Also receive a TM39. Rock tomb. Cool, cool. We, we lost Ian. We lost Kayla. And we lost Cindy, which is, eh. I figured she'd be cannon fodder if I did, if I went straight for the gym anyway. But Kayla, the first Pokemon we caught as a Kakuna. Oh, we raised up to a Beedrill final at level 10. Raised her up some more. She got some good boosts. Ian. Our little pink fur ball. We're never gonna, never gonna see that Jigglypuff. We lost three great, well, two great members. <laughs> I must do the walk of shame now. I won, but again, at what cost? <laughs> Get out of the way! I don't want to battle nobody. <laughs>
listen, researcher, I don't care. Oh yeah, by the way, we also met him in the woods. <laughs> oh wait, no, that was that was last episode. Duh. Oh, I'm so, I feel like my heart just got ripped out of me. Blue it's PC, someone's PC. There's there's a uh, Phoebus, Philip, the banished beauty. Ian. Goodbye, old friend. He is dead. Be drill. Goodbye, old friend. She has passed on. And Cascoon. Just, just go. No one likes you. Not gonna heal my two warriors. I'm down to just two Pokemon again. Oh man. I'm gonna go up here, see if it's a new route. Route 115, I think this is a new route. Uh, bag. Wait, no. I think this is a new route. Do I have a map? I do not. I want to catch something here just in case. Which, there's no grass up here. There's a Pokeball over there. Come on, get off the wall. If I had a fishing rod, I could catch something. Hey, a super potion. Yeah, sure, sure, whatever. Well, I guess the only route we can catch something on is this one. I remember catching a Nincata over here. He took off towards the tunnel over there. Okay, up or down? Route 116. Hmm. Well, down, like my spirits. Okay, who we got? Who we got? A Shedinja? Oh, no. That's, that's just great. For those of you who don't know, Shedinja, when you evolve him from an Ninkata, no, it's Ninkata, then something, and then Shedinja. If you have, an, if you're evolving Ninkata and you have an extra Pokeball and an extra spot in your in your party, you'll get a Shedinja. You'll get the evolved version of Ninkata and also a Shedinja. Shedinja has one HP. So I can't hurt it. Wait. I'm going to use a couple Pokeballs first. Damn it. I can't, I can't hurt it though. Because if I hurt it, it's going to immediately die. Damn. One more, one more. Come on, get in the ball. Get in the ball, shoot engine. Man, it didn't even roll. A great ball. Damn it. Super effective, too. Damn. It only has one HP. If I hit it, it's going to die. I'll use maybe two more Pokeballs. It's not going to roll. You know what? I'm going to hit it. Well, astonish. 
Yeah. Wait, super effective. I can't believe I ruined this route. Ah, oh, I'm so stupid. But that's alright. And you go to the mart and buy some more Pokeballs. Buy. I could buy 30. I better get 10. Premier Ball too, yeah. That's what I was expecting. Alright, let's go train up to level 20. Laura doesn't have 40. That was weird. Anyway, yeah, Larry does. Hey, you trainer. My Pokemon rule will check them out. Okay. I doubt that because my Pokemon rule. Krabby? Yeah, not bad. If we were to run into a Krabby. But like I said, anything except a freaking Shedinja. Good job, Laura. <laughs> See what else in here? A skitty? I could have gotten a skitty. Guarantee I would have caught that. Astonish. Doesn't. Oh, yeah, right. Ghost type doesn't hit normal types. Well, but absorb. You're out of here, Skitty. Oh, come on. One more battle. Oh, look, another Shedinja. The reason you get a Shedinja is supposedly because he's the shell. He's the, the shedded skin from the Nincata when it evolved. Therefore, it's really brittle, therefore, 1 HP. There we go, Laura's level 19. Trying to learn Fake Out. Heck yeah! We're gonna leave Astonish behind. I know it's good for coverage, but Fake Out's kinda cool. Fake Out gives you the first hit every time. Well, guys. Uh, I want to end the episode of Heartbreaks off there. I'll see you guys next time.